So Kent asks, what are some ways to utilize lucid dreams to create health and wealth in our waking life? So in my mind, the lucid dreaming is just naturally integrative. It helps the unconscious self and the conscious self meet on this open platform and learn from each other. And so you begin to learn about your own broader totality. So normally when I give talks, I say that lucid dreaming first allows us to access creativity. And when you're lucidly aware, you can access greater and greater levels of creativity if you know how to go about it. So first accessing creativity, getting creative solutions, having creative ideas is like your own generative AI, but it's connected to your unconscious mind. It's beyond the internet. It's connected to your unconscious mind and whatever it connects to, which I would say would be kind of a, an infinite realm. So access creativity. You can use it for emotional healing. Already psychotherapists do that with people who have PTSD and recurring nightmares. Um, you, people have used it for dealing with anxiety, phobias, and other things. You can use it for physical health, as we already talked about with, with Diane. You can use it to engage your what I would call your larger awareness. And so that's why I call my first book, Lucid Dreaming, Gateway to the Inner Self. Because what I suggest is that in a lucid dream, you stop and you ask a question of the larger awareness. You just ignore the dream figures and just, hey, dream, show me something important for me to see. Sometimes the entire lucid dream will change. Sometimes one thing will appear. But you can begin to ask questions. You can ask to experience concepts. So I suggest to people, instead of trying to find spiritual figures, if they want to have a spiritual experience, go, hey, dream, let me experience unconditional love and see what happens. People who have done that have had their mind blown because on a conceptual level, this thing occurs that will just shock you how deep love can be, how amazing it can be. So again, you can do it for all that. Then you can you do use it to perform spiritual practices. So there's a lot of value to create health and wealth in our waking life. Um, also, I've seen um, people use lucid dreaming to actually uh, uh, create uh, wealth in their life. I, I don't think it's the ultimate purpose of lucid dream, but I think when it's necessary, um, people have access to it.